Folks in the United States are afraid to come to Israel, think it's dangerous. Say, aren't you afraid to go to Israel, Steve? Say, no, I'm afraid to go to Detroit. For family and friends who have their relatives coming to join me on a pilgrimage tomorrow, just let you know it's perfectly safe and quiet here. You're always going to hear noise about skirmishes here and there, but those are very isolated. They're in areas we have nothing to do with. The only thing you have to be afraid of here is falling off a cliff when you're up hiking here up in the mountains. That's the most dangerous thing you're going to have to worry about here. However, when we're up in the Golan Heights, which is where I am now, which used to belong to Syria, oh, there's another trail marker. There are signs along the way that indicate that during the wars, back before 67, there were landmines placed in some of these areas. But they know where they are, and they're well marked. And for example, when you're walking up here, you don't want to go on that side or cross over that fence, because as it says, there's landmines over there. So if I started walking down around in this area that's fenced off, it could be dangerous. I could lose my legs, of course. That's where they came up with ground beef. But anyway, I'll stay on the path. I'm not going to go across there. And I'm heading up here to ancient Susita.